that powerful storm system that will cause headaches for nearly 100 million Americans, including potential snow in Philadelphia and New York, plus more. But at this hour, it's the tornado watches and warnings in effect from Texas to Florida, with multiple tornadoes touching down near Houston, including one that caused damage in the suburb of Deer Park. Well, we have our team coverage tonight, and that is where we find CBS's Janet Shamlin. She will start us off. Good evening, Janet. Nora, good evening to you. The threat of tornadoes has been looming all day here in southeast Texas. And late this afternoon, as you can see here behind me, it became very real. A tornado cut a path through the community of Pasadena outside Houston late this afternoon, crumbling buildings like this gym and cutting power lines in some areas. Like chaos and very loud. The metal was crashing. The glass was breaking out. It was extremely loud. Totally destroyed this gas station. High winds damaged this chemical plant in nearby Deer Park. The person who shared this video with CBS News confirming everyone inside at the time is okay. Sirens warned of the approaching storm as residents were urged to take shelter. Strong winds flipped over trucks and flooded streets in other parts of the Houston area. Emergency officials were out in full force to rescue people from the fast rising water. The same system stretching from the Gulf Coast to New England enveloping parts of Tennessee with thick fog and dumping snow from Oklahoma to Vermont. Right now, people here are assessing the damage. As you can see, they are cleaning up. They're removing debris from the road. And while the tornado threat is moving out of the Lone Star State, it continues overnight for several other states. Nora? Such, such an important point, Janet Chamley, and thank you.